today we are going to see that uh, how how better we can save the data what happened last time we see we saw like you know how to save the data the problem is it is uh, saving or updating every data or every child data if you have a 50 rows even if you are not changing all the 50 rows it is going to update all the 50 rows like you know that's not a performant way of working so today we are going to see how we avoid that we only like update the data that is changed there are i found there are two ways uh, the one of the ways i found it from oracle like you know the that that oracle uh, youtube tutorial that i show it uh, like you know today we'll see that or in this session we see that there's a one more method i like to do that that is literally like you know, i found is better uh, i leave it to like you, know, you to decide which is better uh, let me see what i got it from that like you know that official tutorial okay what they are doing there is basically they are creating an array with a, a single column or id array so whatever data you are changing it that the id primary key id will be added to that now when you are updating the data creating is fine because creating is a new data so there's no issue with that but when you are updating the data you can check that the primary key is part of the array. If it is part of the array, then you are allowed to update it. Okay. What we do, we cre we go and create a, a variable called updater like like a, a say page page dev updated something like that. Like we have it page dev update that okay so this is nothing but an array okay. Okay. i'll add a field it's called id okay that is number okay now that is right so now we have it here okay now, whenever the data is saved, I will be adding that into this collection. That I'll do that now. I go to the action. And uh, that is uh, table row edit and chain. This is where. This is where the data is uh, saved into the, like, you know, the collection. Okay, so here what is happening here is we can call a, uh, I think we can do the assignment, that's fine. Uh, since it is a, like, you know, assign a variable. So go to the assignment. We take the base that for this is the ID is there. The ID is the okay. Now we say base data data. We go here. So this, so this we are putting into that. Okay. Here you are using a default. Okay. You cannot change anything else to like you just leave it default. Don't go for empty if it is good empty. That will basically re assign to that. Like you know, if it is default, it will be added. Okay. So this is added. Now I'm going to write a, a JavaScript function in the page level. I'm going to say that okay. Module of prototype okay. find ID find okay. ID array ID okay 
R A D OK. That is a function. You get a collection. So say collect. Mm, say what okay. Rows. Just say rows and find value. Okay. Okay, find value. Now we are going to say this rows. Okay. Left on point. Okay. Uh, say that rows rows dot find row okay. so dot id equal to find value okay find value okay so basically this will return that the row if it is finding it will return that row so that like you know found okay that's all it is done now we go here delete this part okay delete that now we are going into that action uh, save base definition chain So we are not worried about um, we don't we are not worried about uh, uh, greater than uh, like you know less than zero that is basically that that is a creation part probably like you know uh, call list okay uh, this is a create part I think this is what the update base definitions okay before that I'm calling a function. I'm calling the function here. The function is nothing but uh, find array ID. Okay, assigning this row is uh, page page definition row. No, page def updated. Okay, the ID is page the floor. I think it's base the floor. Okay, base the floor here. The ID. Okay. So if it is there, okay. If it is there, then we call the condition to so that. There's a condition. If there is a value, if, it, if that if the return is found. It is not found, go for update. Okay. No, it is found, sorry. It is found, you have to. It is not found, it is not found. Okay. So if it is found, is just we say that. If it is found, so the result of that is uh, result of the function call. Okay. So basically, if it is you are reading like that, it means if there is a value is there, it is true. If it is not value is there, that is false. So also, if there is a value is there, it's false. So that is calling that. It is not here. Okay. Before that, I just put a one more. Um, what do you call it? Um, fire notification. Say that. So we know what are the things are coming. Okay, just say that updated. Mm -hmm. Okay, just I do a name here. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. So we we'll make it not a persistent, but it will be fancy and it's not an error, we will make it as well. Say, okay, so that will go here. Okay, 
we have done now. So basically what we did is we created IRI or whenever this update happened, we populated the IRI and we call the IRI to like whenever that basically that uh, things are written into the object, we make sure the ID is matching the program. That's all we are doing here. Okay, now let's see, we run this one. Statement setup. Bonus, okay, this is what I'm doing. Anyways, so far I haven't validated that, uh, like, you know, the ID with this one. So you are going to get everything. So, bonus, okay, randomly the bonuses, okay, minus, get also is this, okay, okay. So there's a two, okay. Now let's see what happens. It is not working. There is something is wrong. So let's see. I know that way is not because this is a problem here. This, this is not right. RT you are written point. Okay. That's the reason we are not seeing it. Okay. Let me go and do that again. Run it again. And no, I'm not interested in that part. I'm interested in inspect no review page source. Well, let's see, I'm going to source. Okay, source. Okay, I'm going to put that here. I'm going to put that right here. Okay. It is not, still not working. I don't know, like, you know. Can found, I'm not seeing any problem here. JavaScript is fine. So that found rows. I'm not sure why it is not coming here. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I found it here. Okay, let's see how this happened. Now let me save this one. The found is there is no row at all. Okay, that is a, that is basically the saving is not happening here. That is what I'm seeing. That the array is zero, so basically it is coming false. Okay, so whatever we are doing it, the array is not built. Okay. Now what we do here is we go here, we go to the action. So let me come out of it. I'm just uh, closing the button that is done. Okay, now why the array is not populated, that is what I have to see that. Okay, if I have no television, I'm not worried about this part. Now let's see, save page chain. Okay, now if it is true, Is, okay, it this is where we did that. Okay, what we did that here. I thought we are saying the data. Where we are saying the data? We do it here. No. Is right. I thought we did something. Okay, something is missing. I don't know. It is not. 
something like war return some things we lost the day the assignment now what is happening here is less than zero wage donation less than zero so it is not there okay provided data this is the one now what is happening here is this invalid target action assigned okay it is the update is there It is phone index. Update is totals feature flow. What is right? What's wrong with that? Fire data part of it has a Invalid target action, assign variable outcome success. Okay, there is a, okay, there is, I understood that. The thing is, what is happening here is there's some corruption happened here. So the, the target was uh, wrong here. That's what it says. Now, you have to go and change the code. What it says, um, I keep assigning variable part. So that should be fine to me. So what is the thing we give here is page this handle. Uh, the page def updated, am I right? That is the ID. ID updated with Okay, also fine. I can also say that uh, uh, okay. I can say that uh, what is it? The ID. Okay, this is also fine to me. Okay, the default is fine. Okay, that is the expression. Expression. Saving it. So now that should be it. Welcome, let me go and check it in a little bit. No way to have me so far. Yeah, it looks fine to me because the same way it was created, so there it is gone. So now it look, look, looks fine. Let me run it again. Let's see if we will do it one more time. Like maybe it did the work, but it is not updated. I don't know why it is uh, because I had an error says that like you know, somebody else is updated, some, some error came probably something might have like in Okay, I'm just putting something here now. I'm going to let inspect. Okay, now let's see what this happens when we load up. Still grows low. Okay, I'm just coming out of it. I okay, now what's the problem here? It says I'm not sure what is happening here. Is the flow updated? Item ID here, ID is here. Okay, what I'm hearing is page the flow. The ID and this goes here. So that is perfectly fine. So what's the problem now? I'm not sure what is happening here. Okay, let me go and run it again.
Foto Gallery. Foto Gallery. Let me change. Okay, look like it is not very lucky, so I'll change something else. Okay, bonus is changed. Now let me go and inspect the same thing again. I don't have to because already it is there, so I know that it is there, so I don't worry about that part. Let it uh, come. Okay. Now, uh, only thing I do that is I go to the sources and save it. Yes, now I got the row. Who ask an ID file that is what changed it. Now, ID1 is coming here. ID1 is here. If I am like me doing it here, so now the found is under design. Okay, now we leave that part. Okay, that ID, you look for ID file, what happened? Okay. Yes, the found is uh, undefined. Or our found is undefined. And, okay. Now, if you are looking that the found is coming as this one, right now it's coming with the row. So now it will get updated. Okay, the job is done, it's updated now. So perfectly it is working fine, right? You know, now we are just coming out of it. Okay, see, it is updated. Now they go and see that look like bonus is lucky to us. Okay, yeah, it is working. Like now, let me go and fix it now. So that you see that the only thing we have to tell will be bonuses. That's it. Okay, so this is working. This is this is the kind of a recommended way. That is what my understanding is. That's what I got it from that uh, the official tutorial. Uh, okay, this is a recommended way. Some of I don't like it, like you know, that populating it and all the stuff. So in the next session, we'll see that, uh, like now, how I do that, okay? Uh, till I see you, if you have anything, let me know, bye.